How do we do this? Sine of 2 of inverse sine of x. Well, check this out. This right here is an angle, double angle formula for sine, right? Which means 2 sine of the angle and then multiply by cosine of that angle. So like this. And now, here's the deal. This and that cancel out, assuming x is in the right domain. And then this right here, we have to work this out a little bit. So what you can do is look at this right here and call that to be theta. Theta is equal to inverse sine x, meaning that x is equal to sine of theta. And that means x over 1 is equal to that. So I can draw a right triangle like this. Here's the right angle. Here is the angle theta. x is right here. 1 is right here because that's the opposite over hypotenuse. This right here is equal to square root of this square, which is 1 square, minus that square, which is x square. So cosine is just equal to this over that. And now we have all the information right here. This this and that is just going to be 2 and then we have the x and this right here is just this over that which is square root of 1 minus x squared and then we are done.